with all the spring rains that we had, they had a skin slide up on um, the eastern side. It was on the upstream side, but it had more to do with you know, 60 inches of rainfall than it really had to do with the lake being up real high. So the dam performed well. But evidently some reporter from the Dallas Morning News thought uh, that he would write a shock and awe type article. And so the court, uh, you know, kind of responded and held a press conference on that. And, uh, so it's been a little bit of a focal point, a little bit of damage control. And of course, I've been fielding questions draining through the citizens and through our mayor, trying to dispel all the urban myths and rumors that come in as a result of that. So. Well, what paper reported that the contract in the yeah, they've got a, like about a $7 million contract that they're uh, doing the repairs on. Of course, with the rains and the high water, it's not really helping all that. But CORE uh, it does not feel the dam you know, is any more at risk than it was when they started the study. And they're getting closer to the point where they're going to have, uh, and they've been briefing the supplier uh, interest, what the remedies are shaping up to be. We don't, at this point, have a good feel for the costs, and because of the article, at least this is my opinion, because of the article, I think there's been more political pressure coming out of Congress to accelerate the study and accelerate the remedies. So, not that that's in itself necessarily bad. It's good that there will be some federal funding coming in to help uh, you know, sustain uh, and make the dam safer and extend its life. Um, but uh, there will be some you know, cost shares that will have to be borne by uh, the, the primary stakeholders, which are Dallas and The initial reporting seemed to indicate that at one point it was considered a failure with him. Uh, don't believe everything you read in the newspaper. Right. So I, when that article came out, I had a lot of people approaching me, and it was like, yeah, that's news to me. I've been meeting with them for the last three years, and you know, they've been keeping us abreast. And so, uh, I don't believe what you read in the paper. So that, that's basically what happened: is the court came out and proactively did press release and brought the media out to look at the slide area and to try to uh, do damage control as well. Anybody else feel good?